Hello friends, welcome to my channel, and here I gonna show you, AirPods not working with Zoom on Mac and other troubleshooting tips and Zoom settings for microphone and speaker. Follow the video till the end to get all about ideas for quick setup and fix AirPods on Zoom Mac, let's get started. First of all make sure your AirPods are charged enough, if not then put both AirPods into the charging case and charge for at least 10 minutes to direct the wall plug using Apple's original lightning cable. Otherwise, you can reset AirPods, to connect with Mac. In the case AirPods disconnecting from Mac automatically and connect to another Apple device. To prevent this auto pairing, tips are to turn off Bluetooth on your iPhone, iPad that's nearby. And enjoy uninterrupted Bluetooth connection of your AirPods. Also sometimes reset AirPods is required, because of you are connecting with Mac the first time or paired with other devices. Here's my tutorial on why your AirPods won't reset and pair with Mac. Let's start with the pairing or setup process on my Mac. Turn on Bluetooth on your Mac, then press and hold on the back button of the charging case with lid open on AirPods. Your AirPods flash white amber light, which means your AirPods reset successfully. Now open the Bluetooth preferences on Mac from the top have a logo. Click on System Preferences and see your AirPods in the Bluetooth list and click on to connect successfully. Now, go back to System Preferences and click on the Sound option. Select your paired AirPods Pro under the Output section and check the audio balance between the left and right AirPod. If this setting is not correct then your AirPods connected but no sound on one of yours AirPod. Also set the output volume level. In the same way, set input microphone volume level. And test the sound effect on your Mac system preferences. Now your AirPods is easy to use on any software running on your Mac just like Zoom app or Zoom web while used in browser too. Let's check speaker and microphone settings on the Zoom app. Open the Zoom app on your Mac screen and log into your Zoom for Zoom Mac app. From the top Apple Mac menu, click on Zoom.us and Preferences option. Next, under the audio section check output volume and input volume. And set the slider to maximum. If the slider is not accessible then manage it from your Mac's audio preference settings. Remove the input and output volume limitations. And recheck the Zoom preferences settings. Hope it will work. If still now work then allow microphone by click on join audio and use your Bluetooth headphone as a microphone during Zoom meeting. By default, the Zoom app doesn't turn on the microphone automatically on a screen. Here's my Zoom meeting doesn't allow me to start the microphone but the speaker does. Check the microphone privacy for the Zoom app on Mac. Go to the Apple Mac system preference from the top Mac menu. Next, click security and privacy settings. From the left side of the window, select the microphone option. And select the Zoom app on Mac. Force quit the Zoom app and relaunch on your Mac to see the microphone issue fixed or not. If none of the solutions is working for you then follow some troubleshooting on the problem with the Zoom app only. To identify the specific app related issue, I recommend using the Apple Voice Memo on Mac to start recording using the AirPods microphone. If it's working fine then delete the Zoom folder from the Application Support folder. Open Finder on Mac, from the top Mac menu, click on Go from the top menu and go to Folder. And enter the folder path given on screen or copy from the video description. And click on the Go button. Now search Zoom as a folder and delete that folder. Now. Relaunch Zoom app on Mac and I hope it will fix the issue. If not yet then try to remove and reinstall the Zoom app on Mac. In some cases, a restart is required to rebuild the app folder. Some other tips on Mac microphone not working with Zoom, then attend the meeting on Zoom on a web browser or Zoom app is available for a mobile device. If the problem is really problematic then you can also contact the Zoom support team, instructions given in the video descriptions. Hope you get the important tips and settings in this video, so thumbs up and subscribe for more updates. Also, comment on me to get more help from us.